Carol is at the airport checking in for her flight. The airline has a weight limit of 50 pounds for all bags and suitcases combined. Before she puts her last bag on the scale, the scale reads 43 pounds. There's an easy way to find out if she can check her last bag by solving one step inequalities with addition and subtraction. So let's summarize our given information. 43 pounds are already on the scale. 50 pounds is the maximum weight limit. This means her bag should weigh 50 pounds or less. So we use the less than or equal to sign. Now let's use this information to write an inequality. We want to find out how many pounds Carol can still check. Since this is an unknown, we will represent it using a variable. For example, x. We add this to positive 43 pounds for the bags that are already on the scale. Altogether, this must be less than or equal to 50 pounds. Now that we have the written inequality, let's solve it. There are a few things to keep in mind when solving inequalities. First, remember to use opposite operations to isolate the variable. Next, whatever you do to one side of the inequality must be done to the other. Lastly, make sure the inequality sign stays the same. Let's try this problem. Since 43 is added to x, you must use the opposite of addition, subtraction, to isolate x. Because you must do the same thing to both sides, you should subtract 43 from both sides of the inequality. The positive 43 and the negative 43 will cancel out, so you just have x on the left side. Then, 50 minus 43 is 7. By keep to keep on learning, just follow the link in the video description. You'll get the full video and lots of fun interactive practice problems to test your knowledge.